Hello everyone, welcome back to Innovate with me. Today we are diving into the fascinating world of Fibonacci series and how to code it in Java using recursion. If you are new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification so you won't miss any of our future coding tutorials. Now let's start with the basics. What exactly is the Fibonacci series? The Fibonacci series is a sequence of number where each number is the sum of the two preceding ones. It typically starts with 1 and 0 and then each subsequent number is the sum of the previous two. So it looks like something like this. Here we can see in the image 0, 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, 8, 13 and so on. The Fibonacci series isn't a just a mathematical curiosity, it actually appears in many aspects of our world. From the spirals of galaxy to the arrangement of petals in the flowers, the nature seems to follow the Fibonacci series as well. In many mathematics and computer science, the Fibonacci series is incredibly useful for modeling growth processes, designing an algorithm and so on. Now let's jump into the Java code that calculates the Fibonacci series using recursion. In Java, recursion is a technique where a method calls itself to solve a problem. Our code will use recursion to calculate each Fibonacci number. Let's start coding. First, let's create file name as Fibonacci dot java then it's already came with class in vs code we have some features so public static void main then string args so let's create um, First, we have to import um, scanner. Let's import Java little dot scanner. We have to import and then access that scanner function scanner. So scanner. I'll name it as sc new scanner system dot in then we can put uh, as create something let's take the input from the user system dot or I we have a shortcut s o u t press enter yeah here we can give a statement as enter the value of n let's take a variable n and int capital n is equal to sc next dot sc next int it will store the input here in the n variable and now let's create a class called Fibonacci let's create one here only inside the main function only main class only we have to create one recursive function static int fib of int n it will take one variable as n and let's put the condition if if n is less than equal to 1 it should return n itself otherwise return otherwise it have should return fib of n minus 1 plus fib fib of n minus 2 so this is the function, it 
it should return here then we have to call this function in the for loop let's create one for loop to print all the series of number i is greater than capital n i plus plus then again printing we are going to print of i plus and let's give one space here should one space we have to give then close the scanner <coughs> there is need to close the scanner here sorry we made some yeah i missed semicolon here here we have to enter the value of n let's give five so yeah here we can see the numbers are printing 0 1 as the fibonacci series so the code is correct and let's remove this print ln so it will print in the same line let's check it for 5 itself yeah it's given the correct answer let's run again uh let's give 10 yeah it will print 10 numbers let's give 20 yeah it's printing all the outputs are i think all are correct so in this way we can create fibonacci series using recursion in java you can create in any other way also yeah recursion i think it's simple i think it's simple to create here so watching please do subscribe to our channel for the future coding tutorial thank you everyone